back. Thank Christ. Good to go. Drives like a jalopy. Okay, let's get out of here. Big day. So Sam walks out of the bathroom, and I'm praying he's got a piece on him, because I'm not sure the bartender's going to hand over what he owes. And his two sons, they're inching closer. I can hear them cracking their knuckles. They're both seven feet tall, built like brick shit houses. What were you carrying? My dick. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. This crazy bastard, he waltzes out of the bathroom, just starts pissing all over the joint. <laughs> really? What, he didn't call the cops? Nah. Sometimes you just gotta make them think you're crazy. <laughs> Tom, you got the moment. Oh. Jeffrey, we've got a bit of a situation. Is the boss okay? Oh, yeah, it's nothing like that. Mikey Dunn, our driver. Some of Morello's guys roughed him up pretty good last night. Broke his arm, broke his jaw, sent him to the hospital. Jesus. Yeah, tough locker for Mikey. Anyway, you're going to race for him. Wait, what? Frank, Tom, I don't know. There's a half hour before the starting gun goes off, so this is not a discussion. The Don wants to win, but more importantly, he wants Morello to lose. And you are our best wheelman. Otherwise, I'd be talking to someone else. Yeah. Okay, Frank. Good. Rafi has the car gassed and ready. Get to the track right away. From Europe, we got the hotshot favorite, Martin Lichtenberg, taking some time out of the International Series to compete with us today. Got some news from the grid here. Lost Heaven local favorite Mikey Dunn is out. Replacing him is, uh, Tommy Angelo. Well, I'm sure you'll all join me in wishing him good luck. They're lined up on the grid. They're ready to start. They're off. Lichtenberg's in trouble. There's something up with this car. Lichtenberg is out. The favorite is out. Who's going to survive? The Lost Heaven Circuit's famous first time. And I think the driver's being business. There's more than paperwork getting straight to there today. Let's hope for a safe race today, folks. All still in the mix, with time still what? to go. You're kidding me! What? Ah, the timing from Angelo. It's a tight pack as they fight for first. Jostling for position. Who's going to catch the leading driver, Tommy Angelo?
Are these the final podium places, or is it someone else's time to decide? Hey, Tom, just want to thank you for stepping in like you did. I had six months rent riding on that race. I'd be homeless now if not for you. I just did what the Don asked, Lucas. Well, you gotta let me find a way to repay you. Stop by my garage when you get a chance. I might have a line on something that'll turn a buck for you. Sure. Thanks. I knew you wouldn't let us down, Tom. You made us all a lot of money today. And Morell's gonna be picking up pennies off the sidewalk for weeks. <laughs> Hey, what about the European? He's probably wearing cement boots by now, the poor bastard. <laughs> Here. You earned every dollar of this. Take your girl out somewhere nice. Thanks, boss. You got a girl, right? I don't want you blowing all that on booze and whores. Nah, but uh, maybe I'll buy my ma a new coat. <laughs> Good boy. Go get yourself a drink. Congratulations, big hero. Nah, I just got luckies off. Well, I had my money on the other guys, so drinks are on you. Oh. <laughs> there. Now you're ready for the pictures. Thanks. And hey, when you're done celebrating, you might want to go find your buddy Polly. He's so drunk, he's going to get hit by a parked car. Yeah, okay. <laughs> I'll get him home safe. You mama made that look easy to Tommy. When they start to start it, they see Great race, Jim. Not to win, just to put the, my daughter through another year in school, Tom. Hey. Anything for the Kaletis. That's all for another year, folks. Track will be open until 6. Please leave when requested. Great run, Tommy! Great race, champ. Hey! 
Last time I saw you drive like that, Tom, I had a gun to your head. You saying there wasn't one today? <laughs> when our side of town was drowning in... Is this your first time at the track? Last year, I heard the motors from my apartment, but that's as close as I've gotten before. They'll start to try to clear us out before dark. How'd she drive after the tuna? Tried to go sideline at a five brick walls, but we made it. You seen Polly any place? I've been asked by the LHPD to remind all race goers that the sale and consumption of alcohol is strictly prohibited. An arrest will be made. Thank you. Christ, you're here. If your friend keeps us up, the other guy's gonna send the cops over. Yeah, I think Polly's big day at the track's over. Cow says boo, and the chicken says quack. What does the bird say? I don't know, but the security guy back there says you gotta go home. That's an asshole. You should show some respect. Well, that's true, but I'm saying you gotta go home too before you resurface the pit lane. Well, okay then. I guess. Let's go, Jim. Sweet patooties. Uh, home? Brought me home. Yeah. Maybe. Maybe that's. Yeah. A good idea. Yeah. Well. Okay, I'm gonna. Sweet dreams, tough guy. Uh, I'm gonna. Yeah. I, I don't feel so good. Tom, uh, before you go, uh, I ask maybe a small favor. Huh? Sure, Luigi, what do you need? Walk in my daughter room. 
Sarah, the way I hear it, she doesn't need any kind of escort. <laughs> she's, uh, she's a tough. This is a pack of boys near her place. Uh, the punks, you know, catibiragas. They talk blue, make advances. Sarah, she's gonna speak at the mind. But maybe she says a somber thing they don't like. Things that get ugly. But if you're working at home, this is a reminder that he's punk. She's the dawn's of God daughter. No problem, Luigi. I'd be honest. Benny. Sarah, the time is to close. What's this then? Uh, Tom is. Uh, Tom's gonna take you. All right. Hey, I just work here. Make sure nobody bother you. Fine. If it'll make you feel better, Pop. Hey. I'll see you tomorrow. Let me get my coat. I'll wait for you outside. I don't need anyone walking me home. Hey, we were talking about meeting up tonight anyway. I guess. And you can quit worrying about what he's gonna think. Not the point, Tom. He treats me like a kid sometimes. Hey, I get it. He's protective. He's seen things. We've all seen things. You know, we gotta talk about you stealing food. Hey, I cook it, so I get to say where it goes. Well, he won't thank you. Well, maybe tomorrow's finally gonna be the day he fixes his own breakfast. Could you knock on the door? Only got so many hands here. for me yeah though it's not as much as last time it's enough nona thinks you're an angel the dawn hates seeing food go to waste and this this has got to be tammy sarah told us all about you that right you're a famous race driver tom everyone talks about you yeah she's right they do Well, anyways, don't let the cold in, Juliet. I'll see you at church. All right. Have a great evening. Night. Buena noche, Tommy. Hey, Mama. Your angel Sarah brought more food. It's nice you do that. That? Well, a lot of hungry people on this block. Yeah. Well. It's, uh, it's a good night for a walk, anyway. Don't get yourself killed on my account, Tom. I try to avoid it. That's all you got? You spend all this time with a lady killer like Sam Trapani, and the best line you got is, good night for a walk anyways? <laughs> well, it is, ain't it? Yeah, I guess so. Flowers for the lady, signore? Nah, we're good. Now I don't get flowers? When you let me take you on a real date and not some walk home for the week, then you get the flowers. Nah, that could happen. If Pop's not gonna stop me seeing one of you, I think he knows anyway. Luigi? Nah. These guys have been creeps to me for weeks. But I didn't tell you as I know what you like. I mentioned it to Dad this one time, and all of a sudden he gets you to be my knight in shining armor. So yeah, he knows. Huh. Well, like I say, means there's no problem with me. If he did, you wouldn't last long. I know what happened to all the other guys I dated. I helped hide the bodies. Uh, now we are. I've been trying to keep you safe, Tommy Angelo, all this time. Hey, let's go someplace. Tomorrow night, maybe. The pictures, maybe. 
you can get your flowers. That'd be good. Oh, hey there, darling. Are you stepping out on us? Piss off. <laughs> Don't cast the kitten, doll face. We'll let your boyfriend watch. What do you say? We going to have trouble here? Trouble started back when you tried to steal our girl, Chief. You saps aren't careful. You'll end up in wooden overcoats. <laughs> Last chance to walk away. We ain't frails. We know who you work for. Salieri might have been the big six when he was younger, but he's all washed up now. Mm -hmm. It's only a matter of time before Morello punches his ticket. <laughs> I don't need Salieri. Or anyone else. Not for this. <laughs> well, you hear this guy? <laughs> then let's see what you got, cake eater. Mm. Where are you going there, sweet chest? <laughs> Back off! Going <laughs> straight. <laughs> You're some good <laughs> dish, ain't you? <laughs> Get away from me. Twist like you was wasted on that creature. <laughs> you even touched me in your day. <laughs> I'll give you that. You're bleeding. Come up to my place. I'll take a look. Well, you gonna come in and take a load off, or what? I wonder when you'd invite me up. The bank's closed, slugger. I'm just gonna patch you up is all. Now go sit down on the couch, roll up your sleeve. I'm getting my sewing kit. Doesn't look too bad. You need something for the pain? No, I'm fine. You don't have to do that. What? I can see it fucking hurts, Tom. You wanna pretend it don't go ask Polly to staple you up. What do you get? Compliments of the Don. Take another. All right. You're gonna grin and bear this? Yeah, I'll be okay. Good. Cause I don't need the little old lady next door complaining to the super about all the racket. Just be quick about it, will ya? Oh, it's gonna take as long as it takes. The sloppier the stitch, the uglier the scar. They're right. You stitched up a lot of fellas. Just my father. And I would really go after Luigi sometimes. He got pretty good at ducking dinner plates. So one day she stabbed him with her knitting needle. 
right through the hand. What for? Because she was an ugly, jealous drunk. There. Not my best work, but it'll hold. The scar would be something to remember you by, if nothing else. <laughs> You're staying over. Can't have you stumbling through the neighborhood pie-eyed. Not when them hoods are out looking for you anyways. Yeah, okay. You got an extra blanket or something? No. And the heat's out. That's helpful.